Hello Aquarius. Thank you so much for tuning in. This is your love reading. So we're going to take a look at a couple things in regards to love for you. After tarot, I'll pull some oracle cards so you can get some messages there from spirit. Uh, thank you so much again. If you're new, welcome to the channel. So glad you made it here. Please only take what resonates, fits, makes sense to you. However, it does with this reading and of course, what you're willing to accept. All right. I think that's it. All right. Let's get started, Aquarius. Let's see. You guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. What do we have for Aquarius? Here we go. Two of Wands. Okay. Someone might be contemplating taking the next step here, Aquarius. Okay. They're really thinking about it, planning it, looking into options, definitely planning on moving forward here. Oh, Four of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. Um, right now, there's someone who wants to move forward towards you, but it's, 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 uh, it's, it's really into a, like another phase for you too, the next step for you too. I feel like they've been kind of disappointed or you've been disappointed with where things have been. So this is the time to really bring in a lot of changes here, right? To deal with certain things that need to be dealt with. So the two of you can be happy and take care of each other and nurture each other, really putting a lot of thought here into what's next, uh, for you and for this connection, Aquarius. There's someone here who's really thinking a lot here on how to get the ball rolling, how to move forward. That chariot energy here. Really wanting to move forward. Someone here wants to take an opportunity. They might have been looking at things wrong, Aquarius, and now they're trying to do right. They're looking at things differently here. Prepared to fight for what's theirs, defend what's theirs, and to get out there and move forward with you, to you. Like someone wants to put a lot of love and... Um, care into this connection. It's been a lot of disappointment. But I keep thinking this person's ready. This person is wanting to get out of any feelings of disappointment or boredom. They, they're ready to take charge here. Okay, let's see. Let's get a little more. Look at that. Ace of Pentacles. This person is definitely in thought here. How to offer you what's next here for the two of you. There's that Seven of Wands again. And then beautiful, stable energy again. Okay. This person wants to really, this person wants to step up and do some big things for you. Okay. This person is really thinking ahead and they're looking into a lot of things to make it happen. Aquarius, there's been a lot of loss here. All right. There's been a lot of loss. Could be some breakups here being left out, being, uh, um, it's almost like lonely or separated from each other. But what's really important here to this person is looking at what's important. I feel like they're kind of getting out of that uh, stuck mentality of looking at negative things and trying to be more positive and look forward. Because I do feel like this person is looking at this opportunity differently with you. And it's only going to make them want to grow this connection, put the love and tender care into it and know that, listen, 
They need to make it happen. There's a lot of things that they can do here. And this is what this person is thinking about. So no matter what comes at them, no matter what obstacles they have to go through to be with you, this is what they're going to do. There's going to be a lot of time here and hard work put into you. Okay. In this connection, this is this person's focus. This person has a job to do and they're going to want to do it right. Be able to offer that. Beautiful commitment, marriage, proposal, whatever the next step is here. This person is thinking about it. That's what's coming next. Okay, there's some big uh, new opportunity here that's going to be offered, Aquarius, to you. Let's see. Oh, okay. Nine of Wands. I feel like working together is really important when it comes to hard times. Hanging tough when things get tough, I feel is really important here. And this might be how this person is looking differently. Wanting to fight for this, wanting to move forward. Wanting to be able to offer you stability, the commitment that you want. They're going to do it, even if it's going to be hard. Look at that brave energy. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter the storm. Doesn't matter the obstacles. This person is coming through because they are focused on what they want. They're ready to face it. Ten of Wands. Relieving stress and working together as a team, I think, is really important. You can't be one person doing everything here. Beautiful stability again. It's so funny how you keep getting these pentacles <laughs> at the end right here. This is the goal. To be able to offer you that proposal, marriage, moving in, the next step, <laughs> making it official. Look at the bottom. Look at this. Ten of Pentacles. This is the goal. This is the plan. This is the, this is the end goal here. That's all I can say. This person wants to make this happen. They want to be with you. They want a family with you. This is the change they're trying to make happen. It is not going to be easy, but this person needs to look at things differently. They need to get their mind where it's not stuck onto the negative and they can fully move forward in that brave energy, determined energy. And that's what I feel like the shift here. That's the shift that's happening. It's this person fighting, taking action, making it happen. You too, putting a lot of love and care into each other, focused on that growth, stability, love, work, the good work, the work that pays off, being happy, creating success together with all the hard work, together, not one person, not you, you alone, not them, them alone. Both of you. Okay. This person has so much excitement when they're around you. They love being out with you, enjoying time with you. Look at that. <laughs> this person sees so many possibilities when it comes to you uh, in the future. Uh, this is what they, they think about. They have been thinking about. I feel like this person also thinks you're very patient, uh, very attractive, desirable. This person feels a connection with you. I feel that they feel is very different from connections they've had. Look at that. And they want to hold on. I also feel like this person thinks you are someone who is very smart and balanced with certain things you do, uh, like the, the 
the way you plan things, the way you think or the way you want to do things. This person may feel like when you have something on your mind, you're going to move and, and act in the way that you need to to make it happen. You're definitely someone they want to hold on to. They don't want to lose you. They don't want to let go. I feel like this person also feels like they really appreciate your mindset, the way you think, the way you see things, how you perceive things, Aquarius. I think this person just feels like you have a certain awareness that most people don't have, like you just know certain things. Very forgiving, very open. There's a lot of beautiful changes happening in this connection, that, that switch, that shift, but it's positive. Sort of rebirth here that's going to lead to a lot of hard work and it paying off. Seven of Pentacles. This is what you should look for. These are the good things that are going to start happening with all that work, with the change, with the rebirth, this person realizing things, being aware, getting rid of things they need to get rid of that aren't helping them. It's only keeping them stuck and in a negative uh, 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 state of mind. They're going to move forward here and want to offer you that love. But again, it's not just romance. It's genuine, real love An offer here. Let's get one more. Changes, changes all around being fully aware. This person is, it's, ugh. this person has definitely had some type of awakening here. Okay. Whether you left this person or again, told this person, look, I'm unhappy. I'm not feeling this. It's not working this way. Okay. And it's just really helped this person see what they need to see to move forward. This person is really enthusiastic about the changes that are happening and they're going to be very smart about it and move forward. A lot of energy, a lot of time into being smart about making things happen with you. This is what you should look for. The good things. Okay. Beautiful changes. Hard work paying off. Someone looking at things differently and making things happen. Okay, let's see. Okay. Justice. What to avoid and look out for? Someone who isn't being honest. Someone who isn't thinking about what their actions are going to do and how it's going to affect you due to them not being honest, not putting in hard work, not focused on balance here. There could be someone here for some of you who likes to put everything on you, making you step up, making you do the work, making you tired. Focused on equality. Someone who isn't focused on balancing the scales here. Someone who's quick to walk away when things get tough, when things get rough, when they're called out. When you're discussing what's needed, that hard work, the balance. Someone who's easy to just be disappointed and walk away. Someone who can be go rogue, someone who's in, someone who's out at times. You never know which way it's going to go with this person. Someone who can be really fun and exciting, but when it comes down to the actual uh, <laughs> um, I guess the actual meat and potatoes of what's crucial and what's important when it comes to a relationship, this person can go rogue. This person will disappear. This person is really kind of in the moment of passion, in the moment of excitement and fun. But if it's not consistent and there isn't balance, this might be what you need to be aware of. 
and let go. Rise above it. Let's see. One more. King of Pentacles. Look out for someone who is very greedy. Materialistic. To the point where that's just truly what they care about. How they look. What they have. What others have. What others should do for them. Someone very stubborn. To a point where it's unhealthy. There's no balance to this person. This might be what you need to look out for and avoid. Use your awareness. Don't be afraid to rise up and leave certain things behind that you need to leave behind when you start to see signs that someone isn't putting in equal effort. And they're in and out, hot, cold, and quick to walk away if they're not getting what they want. Okay, so let's see. Oh, oh, okay. So we have deception here. Someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. For some of you, someone isn't being honest here with that justice. They're not being truthful here. There is no balance here. This person is quick to just walk away when things get tough, when they're, when they're really needed to show what they're about, they, they don't care. What does that do for them? Work, effort, balance, stepping up. No, I just want, want, want. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. That beautiful phoenix. Being self-aware, using your better judgment here, Aquarius, and moving forward if you do need to move forward uh, from any negative signs that you may be seeing from this type of energy. Love yourself first. Put yourself first. Don't ever make someone or let someone put all on you. That's not fair to you. And you deserve much better than that. Okay. Okay. Let's do this one here. Let's see. I'm just going to look at the bottom here. Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. This could be a need to have a lot more fun when it comes to your love life. Don't be afraid to let go and free yourself for those of you who might be feeling like you need to. Or that's where it's headed. Go out, enjoy yourself, put you first. yang like the yin and yang symbol twin flames contain an aspect of each other's character within themselves a lot of balance here needed and uh for a lot of you needing to put yourself first all right on the bottom power the power of love is like a magnet drawing souls together. There's an energy here for a lot of you. You're in a connection and you two are very drawn together. It's a very powerful connection. Full of fun, excitement, passion, desire. Let's get some messages here. Let's see. I'm waiting for your reply. You're the right person at the wrong time.
I love joking around with you. Hmm. Very fun uh, relationship here, connection here. I pretend that I'm okay, but I'm not. That's that mask. Someone who deflects, blocks, doesn't deal. Pretend they're okay, but they're not. I'm sorry, I'm so defensive. There's that block. we have here I tend to bury my emotions let's look at the bottom I miss what we had wow okay Okay, let's see. Let's get more Aquarius. Let's see. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I want to see you. <laughs> this person misses you, thinks about you. Person's not ready to let you go. Ex-lover, memories, the past, old flame, nostalgic. They're not ready to let you go. Relationship, commitment, partner, boyfriend, girlfriend. This could be the wrong time for this person. You might have already moved on, dating someone new here. But this ex-lover stuck into the past of what you had. I miss what we had. Okay. Hook up. One night stand. Intimacy. Casual relationship fling. There could be a relationship here where it's just really just a lot of passion and lust. And again, that rogue energy. Like you enjoy each other in the moment. But then after that... You know, there's a break. Okay, let's see. Mask, mask twice, hidden motive, conceal, disguise, lying. There's someone here who is wearing a mask and not being honest. Healing, wounds, improving, mending, progress. A lot of need for healing here, okay? Things are improving for a lot of you. Someone has a uh, has changed up their view, the way they're looking at things. We have fear, afraid, uneasy, suspicion, scared. At the bottom, mystery. Unknown, enigma, illusion, confusing. There's a lot of confusing energy here because of that person wearing that mask, not being honest about certain things. <sighs> Trying to bury certain things, not discuss certain things. That block. Keeping things unknown. Where they're headed, where they're going, how they're feeling. Hmm. Very stubborn energy. All business. Works all the time. Doesn't want to go out. A booty call and bye-bye. So hook up twice here. Okay. Complicated. Seeing several people. Won't call it a relationship. Very on and off again for a lot of you. Thinking alike, want the same things, get along great, 
can be a lasting love. This is going back to that powerful connection, that deep bond where you two are moving forward and it's more, you know, it's going in a more positive uh, direction, Aquarius. Okay. You two are on the same page on that chariot together, making it work. Okay. On the same level with what you want and how you want to move forward for some of you. Okay. Let's see. Two. Two here. Seductive love. Very passionate. Very seductive energy. Complicated twice here. Complicated love. Very complicated. There's a lot going on. A lot that needs to be released. A lot that isn't being talked about. A lot of changes that are happening. There's also positive changes, a positive shift here for some of you when it comes to love and this person who wants to move forward. Is seeing what they need to see, what they need to do. There's a lot going on here. A lot of factors. Reconciled love. This is that person who won't let go. They want to reconcile. They want another chance. They want to talk. All right. Let's see. Let's get three here. See what we get. Unconditional. Innocent support, whole heart. Someone here loves you, unconditional. Judgment, wide open, wake up call, life review. Judgment is coming through very strong here in this reading. So someone again is coming very aware. All right. They've looked at a lot of things. They are aware of a lot of things and it has woken them up. It's a wake up call. That's that person that's going to step up and you're going to start to see uh, the positive shift, the change here. Loss, grief, sorrow, pain. Someone feels a loss here due to a breakup, not having you, you moving forward. Feel like you're drifting, drifting, slowly parting, disconnecting, detaching. Look at that apology as well. There's definitely someone here who wants to reconcile, wants to talk to you. A lot going on here, Aquarius, but... uh. Yeah, one thing's for certain, there's a lot of changes here in this energy when it comes to uh, you and the person you're into and someone here who refuses to let go. A wake up call. All right. So thank you so much, you guys, for watching. Please like, subscribe and hit that notification bell. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.